Hey beauties and welcome back to Beauty Swirl. So today we're going to be doing the very first installment of my eBay series and I'm going to tell you guys a little bit about how this series is going to work. I'm going to show you guys five different products and I'm going to give little reviews on it and I might have some dupe alerts and all that kind of good stuff and I'm going to rate it one through five. I'm going to try to give you as much information as I can. Sorry if I sound a little nasally. It's allergy season so please bear with me. So let's go ahead and jump right into this video. So here is the first item that I want to show you guys and this may look familiar. This is the selfie mirror. I think that's what they call it with the lights inside of it and I've seen this go for like 30 through 50 dollars. Sometimes you can get it blinged out and you guys I found this on eBay for five dollars. Five dollars and people are selling this from 30 to 50 dollars that I've seen and all you have to do is just buy it yourself and you can bedazzle it and you will come out much cheaper so this came in a few different colors I didn't pick my color so they sent me the black one I do already own a white one that I paid like 30 dollars when I first saw it and that was like last year sometime so I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like with the lights on so there you go. All you have to do is just pop this out, put your makeup on, and you have your very own vanity on the go. So I really, really love that. So this product came fairly quickly, about two weeks that it took. And I'm going to rate this item a, hmm, I guess a five out of five because it's a very good product. You can do whatever you want to it and it works perfectly. So I really, really do enjoy this. So yes, I will give this five emojis. So while we're on the topic of selfies, you know when you're trying to take a selfie on your phone but you have to use the front facing camera and that gives you less light? Well, I found a solution for that. So on eBay, I found this night using selfie enhancing flashlight and it looks like this. And this was only $6. Let me show you guys how it works. So here it is, I got it in pink and it does have the cords to go with it so you can charge it. But all you do is just turn the on and off button on the side. I'm gonna turn it on. And you have your light. And it just fits right into your uh, earphone jack, just like that. And you can just take your selfie. And I'm holding mine because I have this big charger case on here, but normally you can just sit it in there and it's just gonna sit there. So another thing that I love about this is that it dims, so you don't have to have it on full blast all the time. And it has three different stages. It has high, medium, and low. So there you go. So I think this is a really, really cool gift to give somebody or just a cool gadget to have. If you are a selfie queen like I am, this will come in handy. So what do I give this? I will give this a five out of five emojis. It's reasonably priced, it came really quick. It's definitely something that will come in handy. So I really, really like this. So we are definitely on the roll with these five emojis, you guys. So if you can get your hands on this, I would definitely recommend it. So the next product I wanna talk about is a product that has been getting a lot of hype these days and it is the Peel Off Lipsticks or Lip Glosses. And I have six colors here to show you guys. And it's from the brand Romantic Beer. So they have like the bubblegum pink here. They have the rose pink. We have sexy red, sweet orange, cherry red, and lastly, watermelon. So like I said, this was only $5.15 with free shipping. It did come within maybe two to three weeks. So I'm gonna give this a three out of five emojis because I haven't tried it yet. It seems very gimmicky, so I'm not really sure how I'm gonna like this. But if you wanna see a video on these, let me know, leave it in the comment section below and I will definitely get that out to you guys. But yeah, three out of five. So the next item is the item that I've been getting a lot of questions on and I'm gonna add one of these displays in all of my eBay videos. So this is the first one. I'm gonna show you guys my MAC blush stand and I got it for $3.70 with the $30 shipping. Yes, it was very expensive, but if you are a makeup connoisseur and you love MAC, you know that those stands are very rare to come by. So I 
did go ahead and purchase it because I do own a lot of MAC blushes. So I thought that would be perfect for my, you know, makeup collection and display. So here it is in this beautiful glory. So this stand holds 21 blushes and I just have, you know, random blushes inside permanent and limited edition ones. It's very, very heavy. As you can see, it's steel. It's in great condition. It is used. Um, so yeah, let's show you guys a little you know, panorama. That's the back. That's the side and the front, as you guys can see. It has the MAC logo at the top. So like I said, that was very random. It's very expensive for what it is, but if you are a makeup junkie and you're in love with MAC products, that would be well worth it. So I'm gonna give it a five out of five because I love it. It works very good and it looks good in my collection. So I love it. It came really quick within a week. So the shipping was really fast. And when you're buying stuff like this, you're gonna buy from sellers that are like one-time sellers. You know, they may have gotten this out of their store and they're just selling it really quick on eBay. So they're not like a storefront that has a whole bunch of Mac displays. So you're gonna find it randomly, you know, from different sellers. I do look on there from time to time to see what's available. So you're just gonna have to, you know, get lucky and find something you like. So the last item I'm gonna show you is a dupe alert. And I'm gonna try to do a dupe alert on every video. So I did go out and purchase a whole lot of makeup that are replicas or inspired or is claiming to be the real thing, but it's really cheap. So you know, you're probably getting a knockoff or something. But I wanted to go ahead and try a few of those items to let you guys know if it's worth buying or not. So the dupe alert that I'm gonna show you guys today is from Too Faced and it's the chocolate bar palette. I do own the real thing also that's why I wanted to purchase you know the replica because I want to see you know what the difference are if it's worth it or not so yes the box looks dead on very nice if you didn't know that I got it off eBay you probably would have thought this was real and before we get into it I'm gonna tell you guys the price and all that so I got it for four dollars and seventy nine cents with three dollars shipping and it came maybe within three weeks so I think that's not too bad for, you know, coming from China and all that. So yeah, it came in like three weeks. Let's go ahead and look inside. So here is the packaging. It looks dead on like the real one. There is the back. I didn't take the plastic off the mirror yet. So let's do that. It also comes with the card with the names all on them. And here it is, as you guys can see there. The only thing, it does not smell like cocoa, so. It doesn't smell like chocolate. So that's one way if you do get one of these palettes or somebody's claiming that they're selling the real thing and you get it and it doesn't smell like chocolate, it's a replica, it's not real. So there you go. So which one do you think is the real one? The top one or the bottom one? Go ahead and leave it in the comment section below. I wanna know if you guys can pick the real one. Go ahead, I'm gonna give you five seconds. All right, so let me go ahead and show you guys the back. There you go, front. So let's see what team is right. Is the top team right or the bottom team? Hmm, the top team. This is the real one. As you can see, the real one is a little bit lighter than the fake one. So I would say this is like a dark chocolate and this is like a milk chocolate. But everything else is like dead on. The font on it and all that looks like dead on to me. So as you can see, the colors are very similar. The real one looks much more pigmented than the fake one also. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch maybe three of them. We're gonna swatch some of the darker colors. I guess I'll do all four right here. And there you go, if you guys can see that. I'm gonna swatch it on my hand. There it is. So it's fairly pigmented. I mean, it. you get what you pay for. It's not that great, but Definitely for a beginner or somebody that's not really into makeup like that, this would definitely do the trick. Like, let's see, I'm gonna do a few swatches on this one. Much more pigmented. Let's go ahead and, um. okay, I should have thought this through. <laughs> Put it right here. You can definitely see this a little bit more than you can see the fake one. 
So, you know, you get what you pay for. It's definitely, I think it's definitely worth the buy if you don't want to shell out. I think this is, this goes for 40 something dollars, I think. So if you're on a budget, this would definitely work out for you. If you want to have like the cute packaging and pretty eyeshadows, I think this is worth it. I will give this a three out of three. That is my dupe for the week. So that is all the products that I'm going to show you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you like this little eBay series that I'm doing. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye-bye. So if you haven't already and you'd like to, make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel. You're going to go ahead and press subscribe on the top right corner. Make sure you click the little icon on the side of it and click send me updates so you won't miss out on any of the new videos coming up. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next one. Dive right into this eBay haul. The first item I want to show you guys is this mirror that I bought off eBay. And it looks like this is a pretty, pretty gold mirror that I wanted to add to my vanity because I am I'm doing a little gold thing.